Hi, up for sale is a 1970s vintage Gibson J45. The uh, purpose of this video is to give you a uh, tour of the condition of the guitar and provide you with a sound clip to uh, see how it actually sounds. Uh, keep in mind that there's a detailed description in the reverb ad with detailed pictures highlighting all the cosmetic issues. So I appreciate your interest and enjoy the tour. The uh, top is clean uh, with a few blemish marks and uh, checkering towards the bottom. You have a blemish there on the upper bow and you can see the checkering towards the bottom of the guitar and coming around the bottom horn there's another mark right there. With the added cross bracing and the beefed up bridge plate, the uh, bridge is tight to the body of the guitar. Uh, the guitar is structurally sound. There's no evidence of uh, belly in the back of the bridge or tilt or any cave in it through the sound hole at all. The uh, back of the guitar has its normal scratches and blemishes and marks from, from normal playing, actually playing this guitar for 50 years. There's really nothing that really stands out or is really abnormal. Both uh, heel joints are tight to the body of the guitar. There's no evidence of any kind of separation or lifting or coming apart. The uh, bottom side of the guitar is probably showing the worst of it with a few scrapes and a couple dings, uh, which is probably evident again from just playing it and using it. The uh, top side you can see has a blemish right there and on the back side of the top just a mark right there. Relatively clean. There's also a few marks coming across the bottom of the guitar. Keep in mind that all these videos are close up with lighting and uh, the blemishes and marks are all not that noticeable once you're playing the guitar. Basically has a great vintage guitar look and mojo. The guitar has a balanced tone from high to lows and projects very well. 